Greetings, I am Harry Larry from Gary, and this is episode 1132 of The Sims 4 Gallery Lots. And this particular gallery lot is called the Gardener, or pardon, Gardener's Micro Home. It is on a 20 by 20 lot type tiny home residential, and there's a little bit of a description. You're more welcome to read. While you're doing that, I'm going to go through these photos, see if there's they do it justice or not. Birds do kind of do. That one kind of does. Really hard to see. Yeah, that one works. Alright, let's go take a look at the real thing here. That's a cute little place. Better look nice in the deep woods. Alright, let's go down and take a look around. get any seeds for uh, your planters over there so you got to make sure you get that yourself yeah that looks cool so what do we get over here we get some bugs some bees some birds. Anything alongside the house? No. inside the house. We'll take a look at this fire pit area and barbecue area. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I do like this little place. It's cute. Alright, we'll just go on in. And, of course, I say we got the water balloon bucket. It's always nice to have water balloon fight. This lot is playable. Oh my god. You put down the bat, Blondie? Oh, I hope you're not going to go to sleep on that thing. Since they did not upgrade it, I always highly upgrade or highly suggest to upgrade this thing. The hideaway bat, anyways. And. Yeah, otherwise your Sims will get crushed to death sometimes. Nice kitchen. Excuse me, Blondie. Oh, I do see the thermostat. But yeah, highly recommend to upgrade that. You don't want your port sims to get crushed. Yeah, this is a cute little place. Alright, let's go take a look at the bathroom. 
them. It's a tight fit, but you can do everything here. And, yes, I am waving. You are more than welcome to wave back. Or not. Okay, one thing. Everything's 100% playable here. But one thing I would probably do is see where this coffee maker is. So they were mixing their food where the coffee maker is. If that bothers you, then you might want to move the coffee maker. If it doesn't bother you, well, leave it as is. All right, let's go out and take a little closer look at this build. That was a cute little place. And as always, if you enjoy this lot and or video, you're more than welcome to give it a thumbs up. If you find yourself enjoying my content and you're not a subscriber, you're more than welcome as well to subscribe. And of course, don't forget to hit that notification button or bell, whichever you prefer. Normally, I publish three videos a day. Not always, but normally. Two from the gallery lots and one from Maxis. If you have anything to say, please put it in the comments. Oh, that looks pretty cool. And, of course, if you know anybody who would like to see this lot in video form, you're more than welcome as well to share this video. Ooh, I think I'm going to be stuck in the trees here. Maybe. Actually, that wasn't too bad. Yeah, that worked out really nice. Very pretty. And let's go for a top-down view, but before we do, the most important thing of all, please take a look at this creator's other creations. And if I remember right, I did read down their gallery that they have an Instagram. So take, please take a look at that as well. No problem whatsoever with the ceilings, which is always a nice thing. Yeah, definitely a cute little place. And there is no basement. Alright, let's see if I can find a good spot to showcase this off. Maybe right about there. Yeah, I think that'll do. Alright, hopefully I'll catch you on the next episode. And until then, later.